What's going on guys? Today we're going to be washing this thing. All right, this is a 2019 Triumph Street Triple. Welcome to the channel, by the way. What we're gonna be using is this muck off stuff. All right, let's open it up here, see what we got. So I've already used this once before, but got some motorcycle cleaner, motorcycle protectant, matte finish detailer, expanding sponge, probably not gonna be using that, and a wheel scrubber brush thing. Leave that in there for the moment. And some microfiber cloths. So, first things first. Let's spray it out. yell at me in the comments about pressure washing my motorbike but I don't care it works it says to Spray on muck off cleaner leave for three to five minutes. So let's give that a shot. Now I have used this once before. It does pretty good. Bike looks brand new, although it was brand new when I did it, so. Get this in everywhere. Hands get tired after a bit. Oh, by the way, if you don't have one of these stands, get one. It's super handy. Okay, that'll do, I think. Now, it's supposed to leave that for three to five minutes. Actually, you know what? While we're waiting, let's give the wheels a bit of a scrubble up. Oh, my wheels are pretty filthy. You start at the valve, you'll always remember where you started, so that's a good little tip. Now let's get to the other side. Just finish off this bit here. And that. Bit of the spoke. And just the center hub bit there. Now for the front wheel. A bit more difficult because we can't turn it. Let's just try and jam her in there. See what happens. Not really too concerned with it, never really gets that dirty. Good enough. Give this the forks a little bit of a scrub to get rid of all this dirt off the exhausty bits. gets filthy from the chain so get her in there and give that a quick rinse off there we go and I think that's been long enough I'm pretty sure we can rinse all this off now Inspect it to see if there's any other little bits that I've missed. I'm pretty sure some of this needs to be wiped down a little bit. So, 
I'm gonna grab a little microfiber cloth, get rid of some of the imperfections that are still left. But because it is a reasonably new black, it's still fairly clean, even though it was filthy before. Nice little tip for you, if you get a brand new black, keep it clean every week and you won't have to give it a full wash. Just rinse it with water and she'll be fine. Let's see if we can get rid of, I'll try not to go upside down. Let's see if we can get rid of this. There we go. It's not going as easy as I want, but it's mostly gone. See what else we got here. There's scuff marks from my boots. It's just normal wear. And all in all, apart from the couple little things, she looks pretty good. Very nice. Alright. Now, for motorcycle protectant. Apparently you're just supposed to, supposed to apply this as soon as you're finished with that wash. Shake liberally. And apply. Quite sure this does say not to apply to big area. But we all can't be perfect. I think we've got a pretty good coating of that. Let's get up in there. Alright, now that that's on. Hmm, it says, just wipe off any excess fluid and leave to dry. I think I was supposed to dry the bike before I did this. I don't know, I'm learning. It doesn't say to dry the bike first. It just says after using that, put that on. So, yeah, I don't know what to do now. Let's pause for a bit. Alrighty guys, so I have decided to just rinse all that off and see what happens. fresh microfiber cloth and we are going to lightly dry this off so just no pressure at all gently no pressure just wipe it off at least just the painted surfaces Obviously the glass and the rest of it, not too bad. And apply a little bit more pressure. But for the painted surfaces, no pressure at all. Otherwise you scratch it, obviously. Here, it doesn't matter too much. Frame, the frame's pretty sturdy. It won't scratch up, so. Apply a little bit more pressure if you like. I would suggest doing all the painted surfaces first. Once 
once you've done all the painted surfaces, then you can just go to town on the rest of it. All your cluster and instruments and stuff. soon all right guys as you can see I've finished drying it up so she's looking pretty clean don't know if you guys can see it because I'm just pointing this with my head so see how we go but she's looking pretty good now I don't know if I did it correctly but it's done anyway I think that's it for this video let me know in the comments if I did something wrong. I'd love to know how to do this properly so I can revise this video maybe one day. And um, yeah, also let me know if you liked the video, if you didn't like it. This is my first video, so excuse the editing and everything else. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you feel like it. Hit the like button, dislike button, whatever you feel like. And in the next video, I will do a proper rundown of this bike and maybe my other bike in there and maybe my car which is out there as well we will be doing cars and bikes in this channel so that'll do Don't